God of Soma has done it again. Guys, God of Soma, God of Angel, God of Kidwire, today was such an eventful day. And trust your girls, they need to spill all the gist for you guys. And you know, Ural and White Money also had their own drama. So I'm definitely going to be giving guys all the gist in this video. Do not forget to subscribe if you haven't. Give this video a thumbs up and turn on your post notifications to be alerted ASAP when I post a new video. Now, I'm not about to bore you guys on the... Um, um, hoh um game or whatnot because i mean we all watched it if you didn't it was the same game that was played in the level up house second to the last week and that is the game where chichi and match the winner it's a game where you put in a pedal or something and then you have to like um ensure that like up to four or five balls are being placed in one at one particular end while you successfully like step out of the pedal or something right so anyways um there were like two winners from each group because they were um they were actually grouped in five and then a new and kid wire played the last game and then kid wire emerged the winner now for his bfs he chose tolani badge neo peril and euro and sissy was kind of disappointed because i mean she thought she had a relationship with kid wire but unfortunately kid had other plans okay now for the black envelope game angel emerged the winner yes angel actually found an envelope same thing with kid wire and then neo but on um kid wire and news envelope it showed it revealed try again another time why angel emerged the winner now big brother revealed to them the twist that was revealed to us on sunday you know we, we are the g's now so we get the g's first before the housemate you know what i'm talking about anyways big brother revealed to them that okay they would no longer be nominating people that would be they would want to be evicted but instead people that they want to gain immunity basically he called it the pardon me please game right and oh my gosh the facial expressions of the housemate were so hilarious they were like wait to me this one i don't understand especially Ural's facial expression but anyways guys they went into the um diary room and this is exactly how they nominated themselves for immunity soma ek sc Ural. Soma. 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 Soma literally had a total of eight freaking votes guys or more that is nothing but god like god's grace now these are the people who nominated um soma for the pardon me pardon me please um nomination that's for immunity um they include angel euro adequately cross princess alex shay and kid wire now when soma's name was uh, mentioned i mean a lot of people who nominated him for the pardon me please immunity whatever you just you know they just they all shouted and they ran towards him and they hugged him now one of the people who actually hugged him um is princess and oh my gosh when they finished the whole serere big brother announced that okay there are three people who are immune for this week for eviction and they include kid wire um uh, angel kid wire who is the head of house um the immunity doesn't apply to the four um bffs he, he chose now it doesn't apply to them that was just last week's um grace and the second person is angel and that's because she um she won the black envelope challenge or black envelope game now the third person is soma and that's because he had the highest nomination for the pardon me please game or nomination right now um Big Brother announced to the rest of the housemates that all of them were up for eviction. Oh my gosh. After the whole thing, the whole Big Brother was done with all of them and he bade them good night. Doing showed her displeasure to Princess. And the reason she did that was because Princess and, and her, that's Princess Doing, Ilebaye, and so many other people actually planned. They discussed on nominating Soma. So, um, Donnie was actually shocked that um, Princess was one of the people who ran to him, showed so much excitement, screaming at the top of her lungs. And she even told Princess, like, Princess, what's up? We actually plan to nominate this guy, Jige, for possible eviction. But here you are screaming at the top of your lungs. That's nothing but fake. She even had a conversation with Sissy and Ile Baye. She was like, oh, more. you seem as though I'm the only straightforward person in this house. And Sissy said, nah, you're not the only straightforward person because... 
Kid Wire chose his BFFs and he did not choose me. Yes, yeah, so so even when he came to me and he tried to have a conversation, I wasn't having it at all. So yes, yeah, so I'm also a very real person, but Doni was so shocked. Like, how did you just switch? You really you literally came to me. We didn't I didn't even come to you to have a conversation to form an alliance or whatnot. You came to me and you told me you wanted to um, nominate um soma so how come you chose him or you probably did not even choose him and yet you are jubilating girl that's some fake fake thing on another level but anyways let's talk about the higgly the piggly that happened between Ero and uh wipe money and the cooking drama if you guys do not know why money is a chef same thing with Ero. they love to cook during their own respective seasons they were always in the kitchen right now Ero said a uh, the uh, white money is always dragging the kitchen with her that sometimes she would even cook and serve white money he would refuse to eat her food she was shouting she was so angry and there was even a time um she wanted to eat she wanted to use the goat meat to cook and white money was like please leave the ghost meat for me like i don't understand it's big brother shopping for you she really went out on him and white money was like was shocked this was his facial expression like girl where are you coming from we're like where is all this coming from like i don't even understand why are you going all out on me what did i do and you know what um princess was like i'm oh, sorry yura was like please just stop the pretense you know me and i know you as well don't even do that with me i know what you're doing you are fake i know the game you're playing you are so fake white money was still shocked his facial expression was like girl where are you coming from and he was looking at the other housemates who were there and um yura was like don't look at them this is between you and i and you know what i'm talking about you are so fake and the things you've been doing to me is so bad and i'm like yeah this actually happened before big brother announced um to the whole housemate that Soma was the winner and they were all up for eviction this was actually after the nomination right during the waiting period now after the whole um, um the whole announcement and big brother bade them goodbye Yura was actually explaining to Angel and T Badge, that's Tonani Badge, and she said that Wild Money is actually so calculative. Oh my gosh. Wild Money literally calculates so fast. And there was even a time she made jello fries, and everyone was just applauding her that, oh, her jello fries taste so sumptuous and delicious. And the next day, he literally went to make his own jello fries. Like, bro, it's not a competition. And in my head, I'm like, Yura, you're just trying to make a mountain out of a mohi because if he if you cook jello fries and he cooked jello fries, eh? and so what her points were not pointing at all let me just be honest with you but anyways she also said something that struck me she said she was talking about her mom and she was even teary and why money had the audacity to tell her that i am but you posted your mom like a few weeks ago so why are you crying like insinuating why are you crying and he had a smirk on his face and she got so offended because she actually posted a video an old video of her mother and she felt like, I mean, you're trying to say that my feelings are invalid, that since I posted a video, I shouldn't feel bad about missing my mom or the situation my mom is going through. Because I think her mom has, like, dementia or so. Her mom has a mental illness, right? So she was just talking about her mom. And why money would just, you know, kind of dismiss her feelings. And, you know, it made her seem as though he felt her feelings were invalid. And so that she felt like he was so fake. And, you know, considering, considering the fact that they've actually known each other before the house and they were so close she was even saying that ah we even used to chat on whatsapp like why would you do me like this why would you be so bad to me like you're acting as if the um the kitchen or cooking is a competition between the both of us Ah, ah, I say, girl, is it that deep? Like, it's not. It's not even that serious. You get that. Even sometimes she would serve him. He would not want to eat her food. I'm like, yeah. Like she was complaining bitterly and emphasizing so much on the fact that wife money had not eaten her food. I mean, you guys cook so differently. She even said that. So what if he doesn't even like eating any other food that has not been prepared by him or was not prepared by him, or he doesn't even like eating women's food? Like it's his choice. Do you understand? Oh my gosh, she even said, oh, the reason why she doesn't even like cooking or going into the kitchen is because of wife money and how uncomfortable he made her, he makes her feel. To be honest with you, um, like I said before, her points were not pointing at all. Like her points were so invalid. Like she, it just felt as though she just wanted to like create highlights, you know, just to be talked about or to create the narrative that um, he's, he's bringing back the cooking strategy or he's attacking her because she uses the kitchen. Like it's not that much of a big deal. Do you feel me? Like I felt like if she did not want to like blow things out of proportion or she was civil enough or she had no she had no ulterior motive she would have just called him to the side and tell him okay these things you said or these things you're doing i do not like 
I'm not comfortable about it. Jige. But moving on, guys, these are the housemates that are up for eviction this week. We have White Money, Doing, Fraud, Pere, Ural, Princess, New Energy, Alex, Shay, Sissy, Tolani Badge, Ile Baye, Mercy, AK, and Cross. So please, if you fans are the ones that carry these votes or this BB Ninja um, reality TV show on your head, make sure you do well to vote like your life literally depends on it for your faith else their enemy will be brought in as part of the jury and your faith will be evicted asap okay thank you guys so much for watching and listening please subscribe to my channel guys give this video a thumbs up and turn on your post notification to be alerted asap when i post a new video you know the vibes do not forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up and share your thoughts with me in the comment section guys let's geez let's dialogue what's up what do you think about all of this gist i just filled you in see you all in my next video once again bye